All right, gamers, time for the new solo mode, Dimensional Observers of S-Force. The S stands for... Chit. A secret society of higher scientific power called S-Force. It is comprised of agents that work to prevent crimes and disasters. Their missions are said to span the entire space-time continuum, yet the extent of it is not revealed to the agents. Nevertheless, a senior agent gives new recruits a rudimentary orientation explaining the Force. New agents, welcome to S-Force. Rapa Chiyomaru is the, is the most senior member. Before we dive into a mission, allow me to first explain more about the Force. I am Rapa Chiyomaru. I will be your guide today. I am aware that- Oh my god. When does this get good? <laughs> Some of you may have abilities that will be useful for S-Force, but based on most of your effects, it looks like you won't. When we observe and detect a problem, we deploy to solve it. Commander Justify sends his most suited agents for the mission via a warp gate. This is the plot of Minority Report, by the way. Before the next lesson, I believe it's time for some training. Okay. Cool. What a fun deck. Alright, I'm ready to play some S-Force. This is not a very good deck. Okay, so we have S-Force Bridgehead. I'm trying to get me some head on the bridge. Folks, let's grab an S-Force. Yeah, let's do a uh, Razor. Razor is the edgiest S-Force. <laughs> so the joke here is... We'll go Rapo Chiyomaru, the special monster from the deck, by banishing Gravitino. Then we'll activate Planetina to bring back Morty. This is just like Rick and Morty. We'll activate S-Force Gravitino in order to add Retroactive to hand. And now we will Link Summon S-Force Bumbly Blingus. Hey man, this deck seems bad. I'm literally comboing off turn one. I don't know what you want. Go. Shit. Oh, wait, we're fine. <laughs> Let's summon Rapachiyomaru. Let's trigger Rapachiyomaru. Banish this asshole. I, I want to keep the guy engraved. Turn into the hand. Edge Razor. Edge Razor. Let's summon Rapachiyomaru. And then... Let's get him over here. Come here! normal Rapachiyamaru. Activate the effect. Banish this guy. That's a good card. We'll activate Laplace Well. Target Platina. Then we'll activate Laplace Well. Banish Rapachiyamaru. Send him to the Shadow Realm. To attack? That's the end of the game. Wait, this deck is crazy. Hmm, I'm noticing it's not actually the end of the game. Goal! Nice work. How was that? Got an idea of how the missions play out? As a shinobi, oh my god, we get it. This is S-Force Commander Justify. We are zoomed in on his crotch. Wow, that's incredible. You may hear him speak when he gives an order, but... In all honesty, I've never seen his face. Next up, Laplace Well. I was shocked when I first saw his smoothed Kendall genitalia. He taught me so much, even about things unrelated to our missions. Oh? Oh yeah, this metal charm I'm wearing. They sell them at the store on the base. I bought one like his, pretty eye-catching, don't you think? Next, Digama. He is an amazing doctor that runs our science team! He develops lots of tech and equipment for us, like the dog tag that supports our missions. Whoa! He's got some bappers on him! Holy shit! Last up is Platina. She, uh, is some... She's Palkia. The, she is usually a calm person. She is very scary when she is angry. Never make Platina angry. There are other agents I have never... Er, so many great agents, I cannot name them all.
Ooh, this is kind of creepy. I feel like there's so much we don't know about the S-Force. And we don't care. Like, they're win con. Fuck off. This deck is terrible. Oh, unless you draw Rapachu, Maru. Shit. Uh, I should have done... I should have done Digama there. That was a mistake. All right. Hmm. It's the mirror. S Force in the domain of the monarchs. Wait. This is the this is the coolest shit ever. So if you're wondering why this is the monarch structure playing the S Force cards, it, it's because Rapachu Maru has the the uh, squire stats. Get him, Gravidiano. Uh, actually, let's get this. We're popping off. This card has an effect. There we go. Got her. Enjoy the monarchs. We will not be allowing that to resolve. Alright, that should do it. Oh! I'm gonna be able to light the dark. That was really in important that we actually summoned him. All right, last one of these. Oh! I mean, we're doing the combo every time. It's uh, I find that pretty impressive. Rota, sure. Okay, yep. It's called S-Force's Revised Orders. Okay. We will be negating that. Alright, cool deck. We are really getting away with murder here, I feel like. You're okay, sweetie. Doesn't like the fuck works. Okay. I guess we can normal Canadia in that case. Oh, hello, sweetie. You wanna come sit by my feet? He's like, yes. Yes, I do. Uh, we go Laplace well for that guy. That seems okay. This deck seems really close. Unfortunately, it's not. they even playing? Oh. Ugh. Goyo Guardian. Alright, let's see if we can clap them with our own deck. Cool deck. Now let's see how hard we can fucking combo. 12 seconds later. My Orifice! Oh! You have macaroons for me! She came back with macaroons!
All right, two more games. Every time Joseph and I see a Shake Shack, we like sing this song. And I like saw a Shake Shack when I was with someone else. And then I just like instinctively did the song and realized it's like really weird when he's not around. Are you ready to know what the song was, chat? It goes, It's the Shake Shack. It's the Shake Shack. It's the fucking Nut Shack. We're a really funny team together. And it's just not fair when, like, you're not around and I want to do my half of all of the bits and, like, they're team bits, you know? They're team bits, chat. You heard it here first. Shut up! You know what I mean! Yeah. Jillian, they're team bits. <laughs> I don't know. What? No! You're making fun of me. I'm not making fun of you. I'm not making fun of you. I'm a fan. How the hell do I beat Justify? They have to, like, activate Justify. No. Oh, shit! I didn't know that was gonna happen! Oh, we are dead. Uh, we're actually okay. Bada-bing. Bada-boom. Easy. Just too easy. Well, I feel pretty good about the S-Force. But I would like to know more information about the sinister inner workings of its upper echelon of member. And also what those yaoi hands do.